you need to pull here. So you need to go back to borrowing. And then, the, yes, we the print receives. And then two documents will appear. So this one right here. Mm -hmm. Print and print. Let me just close that one. I know I don't need it. No, this no. is this, this is different. This, this is, is different. different. This is the one. This basically is this one. Oh, that's right. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yes, yes. So because they're gonna pick it up. Yes. Mm -hmm. So unfortunately, so we'll have to use the blue paper for that. We have to use the blue paper. And this one, you have to go and um, select all. Oh, where's the? Uh, where's my? Oh, you can just go the whole thing. You need to highlight the whole thing. Mm -hmm. And when you print, you need to change it to legal size. Where's the legal? Looks like it's there oh, already. Okay, mm -hmm. so it's legal size. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're gonna, but you have to make sure that it's on legal size. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna cl click print right now mm -hmm. because it's not working. Okay. Okay. But this is what we do. Um, and here's where you put it. You open here. You got your papers here. So it's gonna print two, mm -hmm. two for book. Mm -hmm. So you just have to, you have to count how many. Mm -hmm. So let's say you have your bunch of papers and you fit it here. And when you print, it will come out. Okay. okay. So that's one. Mm -hmm. In the next one, is this this will print the slips the signature slips mm -hmm. and for that it's regular paper and it's this color okay and you just put it here mm -hmm. okay okay um, let's, let me take out this fresh paper that is this way. so you guys you guys are gonna do two printing jobs mm -hmm. yes and in here is like three per page. So that's why I said you need to have it in order mm -hmm. because it will come in order. So when you cut the papers, you're mm -hmm. gonna get lost. Cause right. we, which one is which? And mm -hmm. it's just a matching game at this point. Right. So um, unfortunately, that's not gonna tell you. Uh -huh. but, um, so how did you fold up signature slip? Like, I mean, is there a particular way to fold it? Yes, because, um, let me, can I give you, yeah, yeah, anyone. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, this is good. This so, is perfect. Perfect. Let me open it here. So, I'll show you how it looks like. Okay. So, so you cut it, it's in three pieces and you match it with the book. Um, it will come out the name. It already will print out the name because yeah. Florence already uh, did uh, the setup for this. So it will already come out the name. It will have the TA number, the barcode, which is the same TA number, Some uh, the title, the info of the, of the patron, uh, the date, and the signature. So what you do, it's um, usually sometimes it will show kind of little line or you can just, just um, fold it. The yep, the bottom. In all the papers that come, everything, all the papers, even this, uh, the mailers, you put it in the back and you staple it together. Okay. So any paper that comes, that's kind of loose. So it, it will be this oh, how, one. Oh, so this, oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, I, this is just the tracking, okay. So the yeah. whole thing, this whole thing. Yeah, this whole it's thing. better to have the whole thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Anything that comes on with the book, you keep it in with a um, mm -hmm. print slip. Mm -hmm. So, and this one is just basically like this. 
put it in and it's stable together. Just like That's that. it. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's um. It's easy. And that's really just for our reference. Just our, to have yes. It there. Yes. Because okay. we're going to need it when we uh, get the book back. We return it. Um, we're just going to take this. We're going to stamp it. Say thank you. And put it inside the book. Okay. Mm -hmm. See you. So um, that's that. 